So welcome back to Shanahan Militaria. In today's video what we're covering is we're going to do a comparison video between the American M56 and the Australian M56 and little things how you can tell um, them apart. So what we're going to do first is I'm going to change the camera angle and we're going to cover the American one first and then we will cover the Australian one. So now we have the American M56 webbing here on the floor. We're going to have a quick look at it. I have the American one and the Australian one done up as both infantry, basic infantry riflemen webbing sets. They do change them from time to time, whereas the Australians you will see with um, more canteens um, and not wearing their, their butt pack or their bum pack as they called it. Uh, the Americans all the same, They will you can see them remove this butt pack and they will wear water bottles or um, extra ammo pouches, things like that. So both sets can consist of ammo pouches, water bottle, butt pack on both sides. There's a uniform on both sides. Um, a Y harness or suspenders as the Americans call it and a belt, right? So this one I believe is the Mark II harness for the Americans whereas when you see the Australian version the way that they have it clipped here to the butt pack is actually, or the bum pack is a, a different system whereas the um, Australians have a hook these lads actually have a clip the, the uh, material on the inside of their suspenders is actually different compared to the Australians also um, their magazine pouches are also different whereas you do see the Australians with them uh, they, they did carry the M16 to a limited a number but their standard rifle the Australians was the SLR or, uh, or the FN 7.62 Fabrique Nationale um, assault rifle so their, their pouches had to be bigger but we'll, we'll get to that when we get to the Australians so what we're going to do is we're covering the Americans so how you can tell American and Australian stuff is they don't have markings on any of their brasswork compared to the Australians their borders around their pouches the 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 stitching, shall we say, or the material they use is, is actually different. Um, the, as I said, the inside their suspenders, the material is actually different as well. Um, also, and the American stuff you'll see marked with this big US mark on it. Um, you don't see that on the Australian stuff also. Um, now, you do see different belts, different patterns of belts, whereas the weave goes horizontal in this one but you can actually find it vertical as well um, I'm not sure the time frame but you do see them also the clips for the belts are the same on both on both sets um, and how it's set up is, is pretty much the same so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to change it put the Australian one down here and I'll point out the differences and you can see if you can tell the differences yourself so now we're here we have the Australian um, webbing on the floor that we're going to have a look at it as I said it is done up for a regular rifleman so as you can see it's got two ammo pouches one in each end and two water bottles now these have been camouflaged and stuff by soldiers later on um, in their service but as you can see the border here around their pouches is it's nearly an apple green compared to the Ameri or the Australian or sorry the American pardon me the American M56 um, the the butt pack is different. The actual clips um, are slightly smaller than the uh, than the Americans. The Americans have like little two little hips here on them, whereas the Australians don't. And as you can see on all of their equipment, it is marked with the little crow's foot or the arrowhead clips here to set, to fasten the butt pack to the harness are different. Inside of the material is that apple green colour again compared to the Americans. They don't have vertical stripes on their water bottles, canteen covers and their ammo pouches are a lot different compared to the M16. Now you will see the Australian guys using M16 ammo pouches also because they did carry it but not to, say, not to the same extent as they carried the FN. So. That's just a quick little overview or a quick little tips video or pointers 
how you can tell the difference between an Australian and how the difference you can tell between an American M56. So look for that colour, look for the arrowhead on all their silver work or their brass work. Now they're dirty so it's very hard to take it out but it is actually on all their, their metal work. There we go, compared to the um, American stuff. So there you go. So if you like what we provide here at Shanahan Militaria, please don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification button so you will be uh, notified of all up and coming videos. Pass the word to your friends if they're into military history, they might enjoy the content. Uh, please leave a comment uh, if you wish, um, I'll try and get back to them as much as I possibly can. And if you'd like to get in contact with the channel, the email for the channel will always be on top of the video descriptions. Thank you and I hope to see you at the next video. Thank you.